What's up, Booyah Nation? Welcome, welcome to our top 100 rewards. That's right, top 100 in the world. We're back, baby. After a week of missing top, or two weeks of missing top 100, we are back in the top 100. Now, let's be realistic. You know, I'm always grateful and thankful that we did our thing and we were able to get top 100. But this is probably the one weekend that I could have missed or the one week I could have missed. This team of the week is not the best thing out there. Deli Ali, he definitely like kind of, you know, he kind of makes me a little bit excited. William, w William makes me excited. Father Gas, not so much very good. Um, I don't know. I mean, there, there's some good ones in there. Let's be real. Look at the pace right there. But it's not the best team of the week to get top 100. Now, Booyah Nation, there is something I want to say. Real quick, shout out to Twitter, man. Twitter actually sent me. A, a hoodie with my my at a9 skills that's my twitter right there so follow me but shout out to big twitter for sending me that man twitter gaming is awesome now with that being said booyah nation i really wanted to give you guys a foot a foot a, a road to foot champions today y'all have been loving that series every episode over thirty thousand likes i have it made on my computer i was supposed to i was gonna post it yesterday but i had to give a draft to glory i still have it ready for you guys i want to give it to you now but i know you guys like the rewards so i'm gonna kind of throw this out there i don't even know what's gonna happen if this video gets a stupid amount of likes in the first five hours of it being live i'll give you guys a double upload with another road to glory tonight i'll give you a road to glory tonight if this video goes hamburger on the thumbs up. I don't know. I don't know what else to do. I guess we'll jump. I haven't double uploaded in years. So that, or not years, but months. We got 78th in the world. That is pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie to you guys. It just feels good, man. After missing it for a few weeks, it feels good to be back. So again, man, big thumbs up on this video. If it does well and you guys go hamburger in the first five hours, I'll give you guys a double upload. Right, that, that's very rare. We haven't done that in a long time. Now, with that being said, check this out, man. We get one Team of the Week pack that's going to contain 11 informs. We get two jumbo packs, and we also got the 125,000 coins, which is probably the, the part that most excites me. And you probably like skills. Why does that excite you if you have so many coins already? Uh, just because you can never have enough coins, man. I'm always buying and selling players. So Also, EA gave us a little gift, a little bronze pack. Let's go ahead and get that out the way right here, a little bronze pack. Y'all know my bronze pack method for my Roy, for my uh, foot champions, uh, my my road to foot champions. So yo, we're gonna do the same thing, right? Oh, I was I thought it was gonna come with stuff, but it's not. Oh, it's not gonna come with nothing. We still gonna we still gonna list this stuff. This stuff possibly might sell, so we still gonna list it. We gonna we gonna get in there. Coins are coins, baby. Coins are coins. All right, now let's do it. Here we go, baby. We'll start off with the two jumbos, and then we'll jump into the, the 11 guaranteed informs. Man, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I hope we get something nice, no walkout, but a big flare, and it's gonna be a CDM. Xavi Alonso. Xavi Alonso, the beast that used to play for Real Madrid. Absolute monster of a player. He also played for Liverpool, didn't he? Gamero's in there. We're going to list everything, man. We're discussing all this stuff to the trade pile. The boy Rose right there. During during the um, the game between Chelsea and, uh, Chelsea and Spurs that, that happened yesterday, pretty much, um, the guy on TV said that Rose is probably England's best left back. How do y'all feel about that? Is Rose England's best left back at the moment in the form he's in? Let me know down below. Once again, no walkout, but a big flare. And it's going to be Santi Casula, who actually sells for quite a bit on this game, I think. I think he sells for over 20K, doesn't he? I think he sells for over 20K. After I open up these packs, I'm also going to show you the team I'm running this weekend. He does sell for over 20k. We'll take that. Um, well, I'm going to show you the packs that we get the, for this weekend or the team I'm going to be running this weekend. We're also going to open up some more packs. I just looked up. We got FIFA points. I don't know why I have FIFA points, but I got FIFA points left over, I guess, from last week. Uh, so you know what? Your boy is going to open up some packs as well. But first, without further ado, 11 informs. Let's get into it, baby. Clearly no walkout. 11 informs. Who's it going to be? Lukaku. 87 rated Lukaku. That's probably the best one that we could have hit, right? Lukaku was one of the best ones, probably, maybe. How high? How high? Oh, snap, Harry Kane. Milner. Will oh, snap. Yo, that is actually a lit 11. Lukaku, Harry Kane, Milner, Willian, Schmeichel, Baines, Deli Ellie. Yo, this is actually a lit one. Oh, my God. Did we get the best player? I want to say Harry Kane and Lukaku were the best players. This is actually the best 11 I've ever received, I think. Because, see, when you get these, usually you get some from leagues that people don't really care about. But right here, this is a lot of players that people actually care about. Will Willian selling for 300K. My goodness. 300K right there. The boy Harry Kane selling for 140K. The boy Lukaku selling for... Wait for it. 
400k oh my god oh my god milner he, he can't be selling for nothing right all right milner milner down at the oh yeah what eight around 60k schmeichel selling for schmeichel's almost the same overall as his dad that's nuts 70k Deli Ellie's gotta be selling, son. Deli Ellie's gotta be selling. Deli Ellie, oh my gosh! This is the best team of the week. Well, you know what? What I think two weeks ago when we got top 100, I made like 1.4 milli. How much did I make here? I don't even know. How much does he sell for? Oh my god! Yo, this is lit. <laughs> We're sending all. Yeah, I'm selling it all. There's no, I'm not playing with any of them. I'm selling every single one. I'll let you guys know on Twitter how much profit I actually made. That right there is unbelievable. I'm going to open up a pack real quick. And then we are going to jump in. I'm going to show you exactly the team I am running. You're probably saying, Skills, why don't you try that Lukaku? Why don't you this? If you guys have been watching my videos, you guys know that. I'm not a fan of Inform. All right, Booyah Nation, this is the team I ran. I, do I pro switch? Do I switch to the 4 one 2 one 2 I'm going to explain that in this video. I'm also going to explain my player tactics. I'm going to, my, play, my, play, my player instructions. I'm going to explain my custom tactics. I'm going to show you guys all this, and I'm going to explain the entire team. There's a couple conversations, guys, I want to get off my chest real quick. I have recorded this five times now. Every time I record it, I start over because I feel like I'm not getting it out the way I want to get it out. And please hear me out real quick, Booyah Nation. And if you feel me, smash a thumbs up, man, because I really want you guys to understand me when it comes to this i've seen a conversation about me on twitter and and about why i'm not running my red conte no more and why i'm not running in forms i swear to god to you guys i'm gonna explain it to you right now red conte has 405 games for me he has 54 assists in 405 games the regular conte has played 20 games for me and has eight assists before i jump into that conversation and i promise you i'm gonna explain why i'm doing this i, I want to explain something else I saw a conversation on Twitter and on other websites about me, and I swear they're not bad. The homies were having a conversation back and forth about me, like, yo, I like Skills a lot as a YouTuber. He's a good YouTuber. But the one thing that annoys me about him is that he thinks he's not good even though he's getting top 100. That really annoys me. Now, Booyah Nation, I'll be 100% honest with you. I do not think I'm a great FIFA player. And I say that in not a way that anyone that's doing worse than me in the thing is a bad player. That's not what I mean. A lot of times when I do bad in the weekend league, I'll tweet out like, God, 32 wins, I did so bad. And people are like, oh, man, you should be grateful you got there and i am grateful and i'm super thankful but when you set your standards at like 36 wins that's what you want to hit and if you don't hit that then you're mad at yourself it's just like if you set yourself a, a, a. i want to get an a in math class but you come up with a b and you stand up and you start complaining in the middle of the class but everybody else in the class got a c and they're like hey you should be grateful you got a b and you're like whoa but hey i set my standards at an a just because i got the highest rating here doesn't mean i couldn't get the a i wanted the a you see where i'm coming from like the one thing the reason i never say i'm good at this game is because I truly believe this when I say this. I truly believe any of you can do what I'm doing. I truly believe any of you can be where I'm at on YouTube. I am so blessed and so thankful and so grateful to be in this position because I don't know why you guys watch my videos, but you do. And, and, and I feel so amazing and blessed for that. I feel like any of you guys can do this. I feel like any of you guys can get top 100 if you put your mind to it. So I'm just happy to be here. So there's no need for me to sit up here when I'm making these videos and, and, and try to rub it in someone's face that I got top 100. There's no need for that. Yo, I just want to open the packs. I don't believe I'm good when people are like, oh, you did it because of a mega team. Okay, <laughs> it is what it is. If I did it because of a mega team, then I'm, I'm blessed to have this audience that was able to help me open packs, that was able to help me get this team, that was able to me turn around, around and give them top 100. And that's all it is to it, man. Like, I'm, I don't I don't want ever to anyone to come off in the way like I'm, I'm cocky, man, because that's the last thing I am. So I'm just grateful and thankful, man. So if I ever come off in these videos, like you think I'm like talking smack because I didn't get 36 and you guys are like, wow, man, I can't even get 29. He's such a douche. Yo, don't please don't take it that way, man. I just set my standards here. And if I don't get it, then I'm upset with myself, just like anybody else, man. Now, with that being said, why don't I run in forms anymore? Why do I have that content? Well, I just told you uh, 405 games, 54 assists. 20 games, 8 assists. So we are almost at the 54 assists in 20 games. So if we kept going at this rate, before we even got close to 405, he would have the same amount of assists as the other card. And, and that proves nothing, 100%. And when I say that I'm not running informs, it's not because I think something's in the game or I'm trying to make you guys not run informs. That's not the case. Please run your informs. Run the teams you guys want to run. Run the teams that you feel comfortable with. For me, I feel informs are doing the same as their regular cards, if not worse. So what's the point of me wasting the money on the informs 
if they're not really benefiting me. I'm not saying there's something in the game that's preventing me from playing. I'm not saying none of that. I'm just saying if we have two cars and both of them get to from zero to 60 at the same speed, I'm going to run the cheaper one. That's it. If there's a Lambo and a Ferrari and they both do the exact same speed, but you're like, yo, this one's a million more because the Lamborghini looks better than the Ferrari. I'm still taking the Ferrari because just because it looks better, if we race, we're doing the same thing. So I'm going to save my money, get a beautiful car still, a very fast car. We're, we're going to do the same thing. You're just going to look a little bit better. You, you, you can have the looks. You, you can take the looks. If we're both performing at the same, but the looks is the only thing that's different. I don't care. And for me right now, it seems like the cards are only for look. I showed you the Conte. Now I show you my Ronaldo. My striker Ronaldo had had 340 games played and he had uh, he had 340 games played and 382 goals, somewhere around that. This Ronaldo, 108, 130, 131. So by the time I get up to the same thing as my inform striker Ronaldo that I paid 4 million for, the 1.4 Cristiano Ronaldo is almost gonna have identical stats. So why was I wasting 3 million coins more? This is not a thing of me trying to convince somebody not to play with informs. Please, play with informs. Do what you gotta do to win, man. I told everybody, that's why I, I, clear that, I make that clear in all of my videos. Do what you gotta do to win. This team right here, somehow, some way, we were able to muster up the top skill rating in the 36th bracket, okay? So in the top 100, we got 78th. We were the top 36. We got super, like, it was amazing. I couldn't believe we did that. And the reason for this is, Booyah Nation, is this weekend, out of all the weekends, I had the hardest games I've ever played. I played so many people from the top 100. It was crazy. And the reason my skill rating is so high is because I was able to beat a lot of people that stay top 100, that stay top 100 for the month and top 100 for the, for the week. So, that team with no informs was comfortable for me. And that's why I see I played better with this because I got such a high skill rating. You look at like all the good people here. Lamps is a guy that stays top 100 a lot. Bateson's a great player. He's a YouTuber as well. But I'm, I'm ahead of them because skill rating, I guess, comes down if you play harder opponents and you get the wins. I don't exactly know how skill rating works. I think that's how it works. I had a lot of hard games and we were able to muster up 36 wins in the hard games and the highest 36 rating skill rating. And if you look at the 37s, we even topped some of these guys for skill ratings. So for me, if it, if it, if it's work, if it's working, don't fix it. Like if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So there's no need. When I got, when I had the informs, I picked up 36 wins and it got me top 100. And then I got a team that was less money and I got 36 wins with a higher skill rating. So if a team that costs a couple million more is getting me the exact same thing as the regular cards, it's not a thing of handicap or scripting or the game's handicapping. No, it's it's just a thing that I have a cheaper team doing the exact same thing a more expensive team did. So my instructions, my player instructions are just like this. Stay back while attacking all the back line. Up here, I let Pugba do what Pugba does. Conte, stay back while attacking. Vieira, stay back while attacking. Up top, get in. Uh, get in behind, press back line, get in behind, press back line, get in behind, press back line. My custom tactics, I change nothing. I change a little bit. I put my passing up, my speed up just a little bit because I think it starts at, matter of fact, I'll show you. So I have it at 65 right now. When I hit this, this is going to go up to 65. So I put this up by 15. Um, this went up by three, the aggression, and then I played cover. That's it. That's my custom tactics. That's what I ran. That's what I got 36 wins with. Hope this helped you, Booyah Nation. I hope you guys kind of feel where I'm coming from. I love you guys. Hopefully, I'm actually going to keep this recording. Hopefully, this is the one. Um, I just, I want you guys to know that I, I would never, ever, ever, like, take a shot at one of y'all for getting, for getting. I'm trying so hard to help my brother get Elite One, man. He wants it so bad. I'm trying hard to help him get there because I want everyone to be successful, man. I want everybody to hit their goals. It's a beautiful thing when everybody's doing what they want to do in life, man, because then everybody's happy. So, I'm trying to help my brother. I want to help you guys. That's why I'm doing the road to glory now. I want to I wanna try to help you guys get to where I'm at. And I truly believe that every single one of you, man, just believe in yourself because whatever you're trying to do in life, you can get there, man. I'm so blessed to have people that want to watch my FIFA content. And I have people that want to be a part of my life watching my vlogs. I don't know why, but I love it, man. And I'm so blessed and so grateful. So thank you, Booyah Nation. That's all I'm trying to say, man. That's all I'm trying to get at. Please don't ever take something I say up here like the wrong way or think I'm arrogant or anything like that because that's not me. That's never going to be me. Um, hopefully, I never say never, but I hope I never become that. Man, it's been your boy Skills, man. I love your faces. Y'all are amazing. Big thumbs up. Subscribe. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I truly appreciate y'all, man. You guys are awesome. And, and again, I know people are going to say I did it because of a mega team.
And that's cool. It is what it is. We did it because of a mega team. But yo, we did it. Yes. Come on. Let's get it. Y'all be safe. All right? I'll catch y'all later. Subscribe. Peace. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Double A Nine Skills. Road to Foot Champions, episode number two. I'm bringing you this a day after episode number one because Booyah Nation, in under 24 hours, you guys got 34,000 likes. And I said, there's no way I can't give my homies episode two. The support was unbelievable. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this series right now. After episode one, we made 15,000 coins. So I said, yo, we about to build a smacking BPL team. We start to invest in a lot of players that I feel like are going to be a key part of our foot champions run. I buy Mustafi. I buy Alberto Moreno. I know a lot of people would have opted to go with Luke Shaw, but I went with Alberto Moreno. I went with the man that I know is an absolute beast of a player, Walcott. I'm using players that I know are pretty good for me, and, and hopefully they're good for you if you guys do try to mimic what I'm doing here. My next player and our most expensive player on this team is going to be the big 